classifying numbers. So we're just this this isn't a, a high stakes lesson. We're just going over some 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 fun names for numbers. So a whole number, right, is a number like zero, one, two, three, four, five, etc. Um, and so which of these numbers looks like that? Eleven. Which of the following is an integer? So integers can be negative, but they're still like whole-ish. I shouldn't really say that, but negative, like these are integers. Negative two, negative one, zero, one, two, right? So in this case, they just can't have any like decimal parts. So negative 12 would be a legitimate integer. Natural numbers are one, two, three, four, five. So they're the whole numbers without zero. Natural numbers and whole numbers are almost the same, except the whole numbers have zero. You can remember that by being like, oh, there's a zero in whole or no. Um, but again, it's not really a big deal. It's just names. So that's 13. Which of the following are natural numbers? All right, so I think we know six, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. Negative 13 is not a natural number, but it is an integer. But that's not what the question's asking. Which of the following are natural numbers? So now we have multiple choices, right? So I hope it lets us do multiple. Yeah, okay, so we have four, three, and 12, those are all natural numbers. This is fun. It's fun checking on the circles like that. Which of the following are integers? Okay, so no, nope, no, nope. but these are fine, right? Negatives and positives are fine. So if you think about it, the integers are like everything. The whole numbers are everything past, z including zero, and the natural numbers are everything, including one. But by everything, I just mean things that don't have decimals and fractions in them, right? So integers are like everything without a fraction. So that would be this and this. Which of the following are integers? Everything without a fraction. And that's the only one without a fraction or decimal part. So we're gonna go with negative 14. Now in theory, they could trick us and write like two and three thirds. That looks like it's fra a fraction, but we all know that that's just three. So that would be a mean trick. That would technically be an integer too. Um, but we're gonna go with, that's an integer, that's an integer. These have fraction, fractional or decimal pieces. So that one and that one. Is negative two an integer? Ooh, it's gonna be fun to tap one of these giant circles. Yes, it is. Is 0.6 an integer? What do you think? Well, here's zero, here's one. 0.6 in, is in between, that's no good. So, oops. No, it's not an integer. All right, hopefully you have a better idea of the names. We went over integers, whole numbers, and natural numbers. See you guys next time.